Farmers in Clark County are stunned but happy their herd of draft horses grew by two. One of them tells First News at 9's Daniel Gomez the newborn twins that normally don't survive birth are nine days old, with one of the farmers saying it's a miracle. That day, she was already a week overdue, and she didn't really show big like she was going to have this happen. She was in that pen, so then it was like I opened the sliding door, and number one was laying on the ground. I thought, excellent, okay, we got a baby. Mom backs off, and then she goes and lays down again. Now I thought, okay, you had a, a hard time, but she was doing fine. And then a big gush, which was another bag, didn't know that at that time. And then she just laid there, and then she kind of rolled, pushed. And I'm going, what's going on? So I'm working on the one. She's right there, and then I glanced, and here there was a foot coming out. And I'm going, oh, boy. And a lot of that, if you think you're going to have twins, the second one automatically thought it was dead. She gave me a little push. I slid it right out. It picked its head up and started neighing, wanted to eat. So I was like, okay, now we got two babies. So I started Googling draft twins, you know, like survival rate, and they said it was one out of 10,000 that they make it past two weeks. So then I read another time, and then we heard from another lady that read another statistics that it's one out of a million that make it. It's out of this world. It's something that I never dreamt of. It kind of was a, it was a nightmare ever thinking of have, ever happening. But now that we're blessed with them, I, you just can't be happier than anything. My peanut butt's just a good girl, and she's a, a wonderful mama. I just couldn't be blessed with a better mare to have babies with. It's, uh, it's working great right now, and I just hope and pray that it keeps going. Marion Petrus says she and her husband John are still keeping a watchful eye on the twin draft horses and says they are hopeful they will live full, healthy lives.